I says to you, um, don't overdo it with this one. You know, trust them. Uh, and that's where, even if you're not going to stay there, now they have a, they have a um, pub grub and, you know, um, kitchen type thing as well. Yeah. Um, when they started off, they had a, a stout similar to Guinness. And they called it McGuinnesses. And they had a logo the very same as Guinness, you know, they're kind of writing yeah. in the logo and all that. And they had a lager, very similar to Budweiser, and they called it Woodweiser, with the very same, you know, if you'd have to look closely. Yeah. And the same with Smithix, they called that Whitsmix. So as soon as they opened, within fucking two days, there was a High Court injunction against them to stop them using the trade names. Now they knew this was going to happen, but they got great publicity out of it. And the place has been alive ever since. And there's, um, they've actually three of them now, but the best one is the one in Temple Bar. If you show me that one, I'll mark it exactly right. And it's worth a look. Yeah. Um, for, for the rocket fuel beer and the cheap beer. And you're right beside all the other, all sports cafe, um, the Keys, Fitzsimons. You know, you're no more than 100 yards away from all the other ones. on one of you will miss the flights by nothing I sure. <laughs> Parliament Street, and it's exactly there, right in the centre of Temple Bar. Oh, yeah. One of you'll miss the flight, one of you'll fall in love with some yank and never go back, so two you'll get home. <laughs> <laughs> Instructions, eh? <laughs> so it's alright, we'll just get a hotel, come back tomorrow. 